And tonight, a family dog is being called a hero for protecting two young girls who got lost in the woods behind their home in Folsom. They were found about a mile away with the dog protecting them. WGNO's Amy Russo caught up with one relieved family. Amy. Yeah, well, Susie Kurt, this is the moment Justin and his wife, Mary Boer, were reunited with their seven and four year old daughters. They tell me during the four and a half hours the girls were missing, their golden retriever, Artemis, never left the girl's side. You deserve it. A dog is said to be man's best friend, and the Borg's golden retriever, Artemis, really lived up to that title. Daddy's not allowed to be people. Well, in this case, we're making a special exception. Around 5 p.m. on Monday, seven-year-old Abigail Borg and four-year-old Cecilia Borg were playing right here in their backyard in Folsom when Artemis ran into the woods and they followed. Eventually, they got lost and ended up over a mile away from home. Feelings that no parent ever wants to go through. It was just a roller coaster of emotions. The community quickly rallied together. Over a hundred volunteers searched the area as well as local law enforcement who deployed ATVs and a helicopter in the search. It was everyone in this community dropped everything that they were doing and just on the spot, didn't matter, were there for us. But in the end, it was Artemis barking, alerting anyone close by of where they were. He also tried to bark at the helicopter. <laughs> he tried to bark at the helicopter. He was trying to get help anywhere, huh? <laughs> just let anyone know where y'all were. A surreal moment being reunited with their family. One thing I can say the movies got right when and I think Homeward Bound is one of the last ones we've seen where you know the kids get and the dogs get reunited. Um, but yeah, there was definitely all of the emotions of that watching that definitely much more intense when it's happening to you. I love my family. Thank you to the community. <laughs> Naturally so, Mary and Justin say they're holding the girls a little bit tighter tonight. They add there aren't enough words to say how grateful they are for their community coming together to help find their kids. Susie Kurt, sweet story. Yeah. Thanks, Amy.